Hi guys, I hope you're all well. So I have basically just had a look at all my footage for my dim church trip about a month, no, three weeks ago I think now. And um, because I was planning to edit it, it, might, it was supposed to be some um, like a long vlog, but I realised that the footage that I took was wasn't really like a lot of me talking there was quite a lot of just like scenic stuff and random bits and bobs and there was sort of like not really any introductions to what I did on a day what happened during the day it was all just kind of like random bits and bobs so I thought that uh, because of that I will talk you through the day in this sort of shot and then insert the footage of the scenic parts into the vlog so it is a vlog but just a little bit different, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to start off with day one. And um, on day one, the weather wasn't really great the time that we were down there anyway. So um, we went into Canterbury, actually, on day one. Um, there's a lot of shops there. Um, I think there's a cl the uni there sort of close by. So there was a lot of students around. Um, there is a lot of shopping there lots of really nice shops sort of like stuff that you get in the high street and some like mini boutiques as well um we walked around um quite a bit and um came across the cathedral and um we didn't go in there because you have to pay to go in and we wasn't really that interested as such so we carried on and we took a bit of a detour actually we walked around into some alleyway and then I'm really glad we did because we found an amazing pulled pork um, place that sold pulled pork rolls and it was literally insane like it was so so good um, it was quite expensive it was five pound for a roll but it was filled to the brim and it was really really tasty and I would recommend that if you go to Canterbury you visit that place it's called pork and co and they also have a twitter username called pork and co too and after that we um, had some lunch then we headed back to the caravan um, and we didn't really do much that evening i think we just um had some indian takeaway and then we had a early night so on to day two uh, day two was the day of the worst weather it was raining literally like pretty much all day um so we had planned to go into Folkestone which we did and um, by the time we got to Folkestone it was it wasn't raining which was nice so we took a stroll into the town centre and then we walked towards the beach um because we wanted to get some seafood and Dan always likes to go to um a place called Bob's I think it's called Bob's and uh we got some seafood from there we sat down we had a little chat and um ate our seafood then after that we then went back through the town centre did some shop did some more shopping and then went back and that evening I think we had fish and chips for dinner which was nice um day 3 we went to Romney I think it's Romney or New Romney. Um, again, it was very cloudy, but it wasn't raining and it was slightly warmer. So we uh, found a tea room and uh, went into the tea room and had some cream tea. So the scones and um, and we had a little pot of tea each. It was pretty decent and not very expensive either. I think it was like four pounds three scones and tea which I thought was very good um, and then we had a little walk and then we found um, there was this, this long river that goes around there so we decided to hire a boat um, which was pretty fun I used to row um, for a dragon boating team and that was sort of like one handed on this side like rowing or two handed but one side and I've never rowed one of those where you do it two two what do you call it helm not helms two paddles um so clearly dan had to do most of the work so yeah so we got on a boat we had a little row and then i did try i did try to row it wasn't the same obviously and i couldn't really figure out the direction and uh yeah so i crashed the boat basically um it wasn't like a massive massive crash but i hit into the side um, yeah, so that was pretty fun with the boat, and then after that we um, rode back 
and went to Dimchurch Town and had some ice creams, walked along that beach and yeah so that pretty much was that day and the next day was day four which we um, didn't really do much, we packed up, we um, had some lunch and then we headed home so that was pretty much the whole of the Dimchurch trip so I hope you enjoyed this type of vlog um, the only reason I'm doing it this way is only because, like I said, I didn't really have a lot of footage of me explaining things or talking about things and that, so um, that's why it's done like this. So please give it a massive thumbs up if you liked it, and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye! Yeah, so I have been loving the Body Shop Chamomile Silky Cleansing Oil. Now this oil is...